Hey, what the hell is going on guys? This is Karma Cali bringing you another gameplay and commentary and the gameplay you're watching is pre-recorded actually and I'm just doing my commentary uh, right now while I'm on my lunch break just because I'm dedicated to getting those videos out to you guys for Tuesdays and Thursdays. However, if you guys are new to my channel, make sure to check out the link down below in the description. Um, it's a link of my game tra trailer for my YouTube channel. If it's something you guys enjoy or something you're into, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Uh, or better yet, if you know friends who are into some of the same stuff on different gaming videos, make sure to share it, like it, and do whatever. I don't care. Um, anyways, today I'm going to be basically talking about one of two things. Basically, I'll be going over both of them. Uh, one about my thoughts on the Pro Circuit with everything that's going on with Call of Duty Infinite Warfare and the weapon variants and how broken the system is for Infinite Warfare. This is just my opinion, um, so if you guys don't agree with everything I have to say, you know what, it's it's whatever, it's cool, keep your opinions to yourself. Um, if you agree with some of the things or you disagree uh, either or, just leave, you know, leave, leave a comment down below and tell me what you disagree about it and like what you know what you think about it and so forth and so on. All right, let's get right into it, guys. So first thing first is I hate all weapon variants in this game. I think they're all garbage. I think a lot of them are unfair. Uh, the biggest thing is I, I use all the default classes and the basic uh, weapon variants, like the first thing you unlock, day one on the game, rank four, very noobish-like. Um, that's just kind of how I feel about it. However, guys, uh, one of the, the biggest things with that is you shouldn't be able to get two or three headshots on someone and they don't die and they just turn around and they just smoke you or melt you. I think that's completely unfair. And it just so happens when you decide to watch that kill cam, guess what they had? A weapon variant. You don't know how, you don't know why, and you just don't understand. Me neither. I'm on the same page as a lot of you guys. I think it's a, a complete bullshit the fact that you have people who are only ranked 2 to rank 4, or better yet, let's just sum it all up, people under rank 10. They tend to get better weapon variants. They tend to do better for some reason. I don't know what it is. I don't know why. I, I think I'm an average player. It takes me a long time to adjust to this Call of Duty out of all Call of Duties. And honestly, I'm just tired of the chain link movement. Uh, I have to stay in full momentum just to get anything done in this game. Um, that's just kind of more of a rant of, for me to say. But you know what? It's my opinion. If you guys feel otherwise, leave your comments down below and just let me know what you think about it on that portion. However, I feel like the game is so broken because every time I tend to go to a supply drop, to get a supply drop from the quartermaster in the game, I don't get shit. All I get is camos. I get freaking calling cards. I get emblems. Or... I get some stupid accessory thing like I got last night when I was playing, which I'll have that in the next video coming out soon. A freaking accessory it looks like a damn earring. What am I, the sloth from the Goonies? I come on. Anyways, I think it's complete crap just how they have it set up. Better yet, and then you have all these team team affiliates that you go into or whatever you want to call them, like you're a member of the Wolverine or Team Saber 7 or... Uh, Death Reapers or whatever the other one is Orion I think Orion team I can't remember um, but the more you level up in that then you end up getting it's like you have to prestige twice better yet you got to rank up two different things to level 50 just to get anything unlocked in the game and I feel like that's that's really dumb I, I think that's stupid how they brought that in the game how they incorporated that in the game Overall, I just feel like Infinite Warfare is just completely going downhill, and I'm glad this is the last installment of this three-year cycle. At least I think I'm correct. I'm not sure, so don't don't take that 100%. I might be wrong. I think it is, but overall, I just feel like Call of Duty's kind of went downhill a little bit since Black Ops 3. I hated Black Ops 3 just due to the fact of the movement and that the weapons were all right, the gameplay moved all right. Everything is okay with it. Um, in this game infinite warfare with with how the weapon variants are i feel like you you should definitely not just be getting two shot across the map from some random ass variant that no one knows about also the other biggest thing i kind of feel like now it, it's so important to have some of these things like the fhr uh what is it the windfall i think it's an epic okay that that is the most insane smg i've ever seen okay i i forgot exactly what it does 
but I feel like that's the most insane SMG I've ever seen. I see so many people have it. So many people are playing with it. I'm ranked 40 something in the game now. Um, but the biggest thing is I feel like all these people do, who do have it are below me and it's, they're just freaking destroying me. And I'm using just a basic NV4 with freaking stock silencer and a freaking quick draw. And I'm getting my ass wrecked. Like that makes no sense at all. Anyways, uh, that pretty much sums it up for my weapon variants. Uh, touching into the pro league real quick, I definitely agree 100% with most all the pro players who are, are really against this game because the way the movement is, how crappy it plays, everything of the sort. Um, as you guys can tell, I am wearing my MLG hoodie. It's my favorite hoodie. Uh, I tend to wear it quite a bit. Um, I do watch it, though. I do watch it. Um, however... I, I definitely agree with all these pro players who are against this game. I, I really feel like we should go back, boots on the ground, classic Call of Duty, and, and see where it's all at. You know, good old jump shotting was awesome. Not freaking hovering the air and freaking be popping people out of nowhere in mid-sky or running on freaking trees like a bunch of damn squirrels with kids who have ADHD out the ass who tend to just sit there and like, just shoot at every little thing and they can just pick up stuff like that it's it's insane on how much call of duty has changed since modern warfare um anyways guys uh that's pretty much all i have to say about the pro league and everything with that um i just really hope they change it and i really hope they fix this problem with the weapon variants um other than that guys thank you for watching so much leave a like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys later